YouTube, do not be alarmed. Do not worry the fact that the notification has come on board to let you know that there is a brand new video from Demo Alexander. It has been three months. I know, I know I've taken some time away to seriously get together the whole idea of bringing back the channel. Phones be going mad, inboxes be going mad, texts, emails, WhatsApp, you name it. People have been going mad calling for the return back of Damo Alexander. And I guess what? Just as it's coming up to Vlogmas, just as we're coming up to the month of December, where of course last year we did 25 days of Vlogmas, I thought, you know what? It's Christmas again. It is time to once again put into play a new video. And this, of course, has been requested to me by a few people. They wanted me, me of all people, to talk about relationships, relationship breakdown, and how you actually get with the other side of coming out of a long-term relationship. Now, I'm not, of course, going to mention any names because, of course, everything that people talk to me is confidential. And notice how that whole of course always seems to appear in my sentences. But anyway, I was asked to do a video about relationships and how you deal with the breakup, the sadness, the after effects of a long-term relationship. It's not easy. I mean, I am not Mr. Romeo. I am not somebody that professes to know everything. I do not know everything there is to know about love. I have been in love, but guess what, YouTube? I've also been hurt. I've also come out the other side with more scars than Scarface. More scars than Scarface. That, that is one amazing, amazing line. Mr. Al Pacino himself. More scars even than the new Jigsaw movie, which was a pile of crap for any of you out there that's actually going to bother to go and watch it. Now, relationships. How do you move on? How do you get on with your life? You know, once you finish this whole characteristic of being with this girl or this boy and this girl and this boy proper pissed you off annoyed you like just like now you hate each other now you've got devil's horns you you're, you're getting voodoo dolls out of the cupboard and sticking pins in each other just to sit there and make them move on to the next part that they're having something bad in their life and you're hoping the fact that their next boyfriend or next girlfriend crashes their car and dies instantly that's exactly what you're hoping for a relationship how do you get past that bit where you don't hate people so much do you know what it is you need to find a theme in life, you need to find a topic in life, you need to go about your daily life and think about something other than that relationship that you was actually in. So what I mean is, if you've got a hobby like me, you you train in the gym or you work hard or you like listening to music, then find something that you can set your mind, set your focus to other than that of the relationship. Because the more you think about the negative things, the more you think about the bad things that went on in your life, the way that you was hurt, the way you're pain, you're never gonna move on. You're gonna be stuck in that circular rut where it's going round and around and around. And you just keep thinking about what ifs, what ifs, what ifs, what happened. But it's not about what happened and what ifs, it's about the future, where you're moving on to, where you're gonna go, the general direction in which you're gonna go with your life, which doesn't obviously include that piece of baggage that was a pile of shit of your last relationship. I'm not suggesting any of your boyfriends and girlfriends are a pile of shit, but they're exes for a reason, and you have to remember the reason why they're exes in the first place. Now. To answer the question that was actually set to me last week, Damo, how do I move on? How do I deal with this? If this is affecting me. This is getting right inside me. I've been with this girl. You know, it hurts. Man, it hurts. No one ever said love hurts. The whole big saying love hurts, trust me, it hurts. But you can move on from it. You know, love is an emotion. It's a feeling. It's what goes on within your body body is it's a physical emotion it's not a mental emotion well i guess it could be a bit of two so it's how you deal with the energy that's within your body in order to help you to combat that in order to help you to move on to find a better kind of solution to how you deal with it sometimes people keep memories sometimes destroying those memories getting rid of those old photographs those old diaries those old text messages the old facebook posts probably the best way in helping you to move forward and helping you to create a new life with a new partner and of course when you have got a new partner take pictures with them and start to make new memories fresh memories start to include them in your life and help your life to become better than it was before so guys that was my brand new video back on relationship advice and how many of you have been so excited to see Damo's face back again on your YouTube? Are we going to be back for good? Well, we are now recording in 4K. We have a better quality camera and we have come back for today. So quite possibly we may be back with another video soon. If you do, and this is the big question, guys. If you do want to see Damo back on your YouTube in a more of a regular, comment below in the comment section below. Give it a like, give it a subscribe, and I will be back again soon. I promise you with a new video, some brand new styles. Some brand new scenarios. And of course, with the arrival of Vlogmas just around the corner, could we do 25 daily uploads again this year? Who knows? But until then, Damo signing out for this Sunday on Relationship Advice. Whoever give me this time.